Hey, what's up, guys? It's Da Vinci, and today I'm back with another video. Today I'm gonna be making a currency alchemist type style of beat. So basically, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna play out a, a melody, and then I'm gonna sample it and then try to flip my own melody. And yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool. So um, yeah, so I'm gonna be working at Ableton today. Uh, I'm gonna be working off this little drum loop I found in this uh, Cooking Souls kit. Just something pretty simple to like kind of like play off of but um yeah so i'm about to open up uh this plugin stage 73 so now we got kind of a old vintage style sounding type rose all right cool let me get this i think we gonna slow it down a little bit more to 75 bpm so I want to make it like super like kind of like slow and wavy sounding. Okay. So now I'm going to try to play some chords that are kind of like Should be cool. See if I pitch it down a tiny bit, what that would sound like. <coughs> Let me see what that would sound like. Yeah, I kind of like that locate a little better. Kind of a little darker sounding.
sound right there. should be straight right there so let me see I'm gonna do some slight quantization on this I'm gonna put like 50 percent okay, okay let me see i think we'll put some effects on this sound right here like the rose in this lower octave but i just want to see what they would sound like up a little more some guitar to this so i'm gonna just plug in my guitar really quick and go get it all right let me see if my guitar is tuned really quick let's see put on some guitar rig on this uh, before I record it and if you guys don't know guitar rig is a really great plugin to use whenever you're recording guitar um, just, they got a lot of really cool like effects in there and really cool guitar amps My go-to uh, effect is usually this um, basic jazz amp, uh, and I usually do I turn the gate up a little bit, just get rid of all that background noise. This sounds pretty sick, and I usually just throw RC20 on it. <laughs> this is just like my stock like guitar, like preset. <laughs> Should be some cool takes in there. Let me just run it back real quick and see.
it see if you can find any other cool pitches. <laughs> That's like one note to fill it in, kind of like, kind of like a, some vol like a choir effect or something like that. I don't know. Let me let me see what we can find really quick in Omni Sphere. Uh, so I'm gonna go down to the vinyl, um, vinyl low five. I'm gonna try to find like a weird sound to add. Kind of the sound I was kind of looking for. Let me play that. Actually, wait, that one sound. What was this? This sound? Nah. Kind of like. Kind of like this. I just want to hear how this sound would sound. I feel like this sound. I, I want like a really like weird sound in there. Kind of like make it throw it off. <laughs> thing I kind of want to mess around with is um before we so this melody is basically done and I feel like it's, it's good enough for us to sample now but really quick I the one thing I do want to try before we start is I want to see what it would sound like if we uh try to like make the bass sound a little more funkier so let me see what this would sound like <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video of how to make a 
kind of currency alchemist style beat i know i didn't sample a song in this video and this might not be like exactly how one of the beat sounds but i don't know i kind of just freestyled this but i hope you guys enjoyed this if you guys like it make sure to like comment subscribe and